WFNN. Headline News Update. Okay, folks, good afternoon. Larry Pesavento for TFNN. And they're going to have to hold on just a second because something good is happening here at TFNN, at least from our perspective is, and that is we've uh, had a position in the soybean oil today and uh, the limit minders still are popping up. So I got to turn that off and then we'll get talking about what's going on here uh, with the markets. I'll cover that in a little bit about the soybean oil. I'm bringing uh, the chart of Boeing Airlines up, folks, because that's in the news. It's very, very important what happened. Uh, they lost a door. Uh, I don't know if you saw any of the videos, but boy, you talk about being scary. And I've flown so much over the years. That's one thing that uh, I always worry about is uh, stuff like that. But boy, oh boy, that was really scary to see a door pop open. Luckily, there was nobody in the two seats uh, by the door, which was good, and no one was killed. But it's hurt Boeing stock. You see, it's down. It was, was down about 10 percent. It's only down about 8 percent right now. And, uh, but it was it was scheduled to go down anyway. You can see here we were looking at a, a beautiful 382 retracement here on the close on Friday. This was just an hourly chart. And then, of course, you had the big move down. And that's nothing more than an ABCD. Now, the Dow Jones at one time was down 200 points, folks. And it rallied back to be up on the day, believe it or not. As a matter of fact, just a few seconds before we came on the air, the Dow Jones hit a 61% retracement of the whole move down at 37723. It's now trading at 37712. Very, very interesting. We've got a bunch of charts to show you uh, when our break comes up after we pay a few bills here for TFNN, and we'll go over some of these. This is a very exciting day because it's January 8th, and everybody knows what day that is. Anybody that's been in Tupelo, Mississippi or Graceland knows who was born on that day. Anyway, we're going to be looking at several things, the stock index futures, the soybean oil. We're going to be looking at crude oil, big move in crude oil overnight coming off that 6.8% retracement we had on Friday. And then also the Treasury bonds are rocking and rolling again. So all of these things are happening over these cycle dates. Uh, today's one of them, of course. It extends through the 10th. Our guest today is Norm Winsky of Astro Trends. So stay with us. We'll be right back. 